This podcast is produced by the Harwood Productions Podcast Network. To learn more about the network and to find more of our shows, visit us online at www.harwoodpodcast.com. So I'm here at the Boinks booth. They make all kinds of great software programs. And I'm here with, what's your name? Achim. Uh, and this is Boinks TV. Now, this is, I've been fascinated with this application for a long time. It's essentially a live video switching application, right? Uh, yeah, but um, it does a lot, of, lot more than just video switching. We have uh, up to 60 different layers you can use. Um, they do overlay, they do lower cert. We have a clock. We have uh, also a Twitter layer, which uh, displays Twitter tweets. Oh, that'd, be, that'd be great for some kind of live show or something like that. Yeah, right, you're correct, yeah. And also we have a, a, a ability to have a green screen, so you can remove uh, the green screen and have any kind of backdrop or fancy moving background animation. So some pretty high-end effects to be doing, particularly on the fly. So we are creating a document um, just from scratch, so you can see how it builds up, because it's like Photoshop. For, except it's for videos, so um, all the layers go on top of each other. Um, here you can see the, we use the eyesight here as a general demo. Um, the placer layer just displays the single video. And then in the layer uh, library, you have all kinds of animations, overlays, uh, what have you. Um, let's see, uh, normally you used to have a uh, station logo, so we have a station logo layer, which goes on top of it. Uh, very nice, very drag and drop interface. Yeah, right. Um, and I have to switch it live here, and then we can see, maybe I can put it a little bit bigger. Very cool, and this can be used either to, um, obviously it's meant to be used live, but you could be recording the live stream for post-processing later, or you could be um, probably sending it out to some kind of a live streaming service like Ustream, for example. Yeah, correct. Um, currently, there are two ways to, to have the end product. Uh, we can record directly to disk, and in the end, you have a QuickTime file, which is finished. You don't have a post-production. Or you can use a second monitor to grab that signal and bring it to Ustream, for example. Yeah. Very cool stuff. And uh, how much uh, how much does it cost if people want to check it out for themselves? So we have two flavors. It's four ninety nine for the regular version, and it's one ninety nine for the sponsored edition. Which means we buy for three hundred bucks, we buy uh, advertising space in your podcast show, for example. Um, which means you have to bring in a five second ad of our made with Boeing TV movie. That's a, that's a very nice setup, very nice. And it can do high definition as well? Yeah, it depends on your hardware, because high definition means a lot of data, a lot of video data, and you have to have a big machine to do. Right, so if you want to do high definition, live green screen, you're going to need a, a lot of horsepower to be able to do that. Yeah, yeah. Very cool stuff. And we, actually, we display the uh, amount of use, the, the graphics card here, let's see, Currently, it runs at 11%, so we can put another layer on top of it until it reaches 100%, and then we are starting to drop frames. The machine doesn't crash or anything, but we're ju just starting dropping frames. That's very nice. You can see it when you're about to approach the limit of your machine. Correct. And in, in the live production, you can think of, oh, wh what layer do I have to switch off that I'm back to my normal rate? So in a live situation, you have to make the decision fast, and then you just hit the live button and switch it off. Yeah. Very simple. Very much like Photoshop, turning layers on and off. Very cool. And where can people go to find out uh, more about Boinks? Uh, they go to www.boinks.com, and there's everything online also for all our other applications. Thank you so much. Be sure to check them out, boinks.com. <laughs>